Are you? Hi. 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 I'm almost certain I've got the correct diagnosis of patient 347. With these cases, subjects are often prone to make mistakes under pressure. I know she's a fraud. I just need to find a way to prove it. Maxine, I've been hoping to talk to you. Yeah, well, I've got nothing to say to you. I'm sorry for upsetting you. It's just how I work. I can ruffle a few feathers. But I've managed to get my hands on a new form of treatment, one that can really help you. If your symptoms are as bad as you say, can you really afford to turn your back on this? New treatment. See, that sounds too good to be true since I've been let down in the past. I promise you, this is different. When you come to my office, I'm sure this is just what you need in your condition. You want me to take them right now? Of course. I don't think you realize how lucky you are. These little wonder pills aren't even available on the NHS yet. But of course I know people. I thought we were just discussing things. I mean, shouldn't we wait? What, what if I'm allergic to them or something? It might be strong stuff, but they've been fully approved by the FDA in America, and they've had some brilliant results from patients with similar symptoms. I thought you'd be snatching my hand off the amount of pain you said you're in. I am in constant pain. There you go, then. Unless, of course, there's a reason why you shouldn't take them. took them. Do you know what they were? I need to leave. They're just mints. I was trying to force your hand, get you to admit you're faking your symptoms. I didn't think you'd actually take them. How dare you? You tricked me. I'm a vulnerable patient. I should sue you. You've wasted hundreds of pounds on tests and scans you don't need. Why do you think the NHS should give you any more? Sorry, but you took what you thought was a potentially dangerous drug just to maintain your lie. Surely you understand how serious that is. No, you, you're twisting things. You've got it wrong. I don't think I have. I see you're off your crutches. You're suffering from a factitious disorder. Some people call it Munchausen's. Really? And have you got a treatment for that too? Some chewing gum that works wonders. There's no simple cure. It's a long road that starts with you being honest and admitting the truth. When you start with Damon, he deserves to know. He's been worried about you for months. You are ill, Maxine, just not in the way they think. Max, thank God. Something serious has happened, hasn't it? Why didn't you tell me about the hospital appointment? I'm so sorry, it's just... It's just that this changes everything. Whatever it is, we'll face it together. Listen to me. Everything is about you. Forget work, forget friends. You are my main priority. There's nothing in the world that's more important to me than getting you better again. <laughs> 